Hi guys, we're doing a bit 180 on the channel style videos instead of doing the video that I did last time which was more of an edited stream video I'm actually going to go for vlogs uh, I've always loved vlogs it might be my favorite video to watch on YouTube no matter if it's like van life people just normal life artists everything so I think I'm just excited to be filming and I'm excited to share my life with you guys. Um, I know I made a, a vlog channel specifically for this, uh, which is called Dina Studio Days, but I've decided that it's called Dina Studio Days <laughs> and I'm not gonna have a studio. I'm gonna be traveling. So I mentioned this in a previous video, probably a project-based video, I think, that I'm going to start traveling full-time as a digital nomad artist, which is really exciting. I don't think there's been very many people doing that on YouTube, like an artist. Uh, and I really just want to share that with you guys and I think it's going to be very interesting. I think some vlogs like this one might be a bit boring <laughs> because I'm still in my apartment or like house and we're packing up, uh, but I think it'll slowly kind of turn into something very interesting when I'm in different countries and uh, I hope you guys are excited for it. I know that some people might not be very interesting in this sort of material, this sort of videos, and that's completely fine. I'm doing, it's kind of like, as I said, a 180. It's something completely new and people are probably going to, some people are gonna not be happy and some people are gonna be happy, who knows? I'm just gonna do what, I, what makes me happy and I think that's more important than anything. I am gonna try and put some draw with me into this video and like just the vlogs in general because I am going to be drawing and I can talk while drawing and I think it'll kind of bring back some elements that you guys loved from my last year on YouTube but also put in me talking to the camera, just my updates in life, what I'm doing yeah, I think it's going to be fun I also got a new camera for this so I'm really excited for that you'll see a few clips of me comparing the old one to the new one if you're interested <laughs> and uh this is actually later in the week, Dina. You're gonna go back to earlier in the week, Dina. In a second, I just thought I would do a new kind of intro <laughs> to kind of explain what's what's going on. And uh, I hope you guys are excited. All right, back to the back to the vlog. <laughs> so I thought I would show you guys the current state of my 
office <laughs> slash studio, it is very empty compared to what you've seen before. I put in some clips of when it was really nice. Um, that used to be completely full. That used to be completely full. This used to be completely full, but it's now empty. Um, and this wall used to have a lot of art on it, but it's there's nothing on there now. Just a few marks that I have to solve. Uh, but yeah, this is my current workstation, just to block out some sun there, but it's not very exciting. But that's kind of the part of getting rid of everything that you have, isn't it? Um, so I'm going to be traveling with my MacBook, my iPad, that stand that you can see there, two hard drives, and all of the things that you see here. I'm not sure about this one yet. This is headphones, but I'm not sure I need them. They're a bit big. And uh, yeah, these things as well, I think. So that's fun. Not the plant. That'd be weird. <laughs> so I thought, since I got myself a new camera, that I could show you guys a bit of a difference between the previous vlog camera slash camera for everything else that I had versus the new camera, which I'm very excited about. You should see a split view or like a switch between, but I'm just really excited about this one <laughs> because it's a Sony V. Why? Well, ZV1, and this is a Canon 7, no, Canon G GX, what? G7X Mark II. There we go, it's a bit of a mouthful, but I've loved it for like two, three years, and it's been really good, but I've always kind of been annoyed with like how my face looks in it, but this seems to be a lot softer. It also has a defocus button, which means that everything in the background can go out of focus, which is really nice. Um, it's just made for vloggers. It also has a better microphone. I think it sounds better. I'm not 100% sure. And yeah, there's just quite a few things that I seem to enjoy with this one more. It also has really good autofocus. It'll always stay like focused on my face compared to this one, which takes a bit of time to focus on anything else on my face, I think. There we go. So I really, really enjoy the new one. Um, I'm going to sell this one. This is just the last clip I'm going to do. And uh, I hope you guys will enjoy like the difference and the upgrade. I think it's an upgrade. <laughs> I just really wanted to kind of fuel my want to vlog. And to do that, I just found this camera and I was like, yes, I'm getting it. And uh, it's just more perfect for me than the RX series, RX100 series, which is like Sony's competitors to that one. But they're a lot more expensive. But this one, they just took out everything that was like for photos and just put in better things for filming and vlogging. So here we are, new quality me. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> so just to show you guys, this is the old one with the flip up screen like that. Yeah, 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 look at this one. So yeah, that's, that's the old camera. And I'll show you guys the new camera with the old camera. Because that's the only only way I can really do it. This is the new camera. Uh, ta -da! Ta -da! <laughs> I really, really like it. It's going to be really cool to see it on travel um, and see how it works when I'm traveling. This is another cool feature. Twist it. Close it. It turns off. I love it. <laughs> so I thought since one of my to-dos today is to finish um, a lizard unicorn that I started, I thought we can do this part. You've, all, you've already seen the start of this um, unicorn in the beginning of this vlog, but I'll finish it today on, with you guys while I'm talking. Because I'm sure a lot of you guys are kind of missing my draw with me. And honestly, I, I miss them too, um, but they are not going to go back to what they used to be. Um, I'm fine with doing this sort of thing where I am drawing on my iPad. The thing is, I'm, I am going to bring um, bring things to be able to do traditional work on the road, but it's just a lot easier for me to do um, digital as you can see my this is my new ipad i got it 
which my may yeah may and I've used it for everything since then and it's just working so well and I'm just excited to just keep using it and uh, yeah I hope you guys will enjoy my art even though it's not the watercolor stuff again but at least this one you can see my hand moving and that's that's a big plus that you didn't get before with my critter did you so yeah hopefully you guys stick around and hang out but I'm just excited to share kind of my life with you guys again I know my vlog in my period this is why I said that um, this might be popular for some people and not so much for other people when it comes to I think my um, subscriber base is pretty split when it comes to things like this and uh, I'm kind of okay with that um, at this point I just want to enjoy making videos again I'm not too fussed about how many people watch it so if my viewers go down drastically which is already it already kind of has um, but at least I'll be making something that I find enjoyable not that I didn't find streams and stuff enjoyable before but it wasn't it wasn't hmm. I can say I, I didn't want to do it like I, I wasn't excited about it it got into a pattern and I got used to it and sure I think on YouTube you kind of have to be consistent but I wasn't enjoying it and I really do enjoy filming and I really do enjoy videos but I had to look at myself and look at what I enjoy watching myself and I really really enjoy van lifers Anyone who, who are traveling and working, no matter what they're doing, I just love seeing their lives. Um, even though it can be a bit oversharing sometimes, which I'm sure I'm going to probably overshare as well. There's just something about living through someone else. <laughs> which sounds really creepy as well, I don't mean it like that. Um, but I'm hoping that you guys will enjoy kind of going traveling with me and just just experience what I'm going to experience through me. I'm going to show you Oslo. I am so excited to show you guys Oslo. Um, this is where I grew up in Norway. It's the big city, but it's not that big. <laughs> and I'm going to vlog there and I'm going to show you around and I'm so excited. I'm just excited. Stressed, but excited. Um, my boyfriend as well is excited and stressed. He's in a, currently in like a big job, so it's a bit of a wrong time for him to be start traveling, but... <laughs> Um, we're, we're, we have been pushing it for so long and we've been here for so long that we just we, we just need to get out we we have friends here sure but we don't have jobs here and there's no reason for us to stay in this location for any longer if we're not gonna stay for a long a, a, another two years you know so yeah we're traveling even though the world says we shouldn't <laughs> Um, it's okay though. Going back to Norway is a bit of the the first comfortable step because I know the city, it's not a shock. We'll also get to stay with my parents or like in their apartment while they're gone and which will save some money on the rent. It's great. I'm very happy, very very grateful that they actually suggested that. I said that we were going to get an Airbnb in Oslo and they were like, no, 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 no. <laughs> we're not going to be in Oslo, take our apartment. And I'm like, okay, thank you. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's currently... I'll close that, I don't really need that. Currently, what's happening? Also, I'm really... Oh, I know I've mentioned how much I love this camera, but can I just mention it again? Because I'm connecting it now to a power outlet and I can record for as long as I want without draining the battery. I can also use it as a web camera, which means that if I want to stream um, traditional art, I can because this camera is so much better than a webcam. So I'm excited for everything. I'm also in a lot better mood today than I was yesterday. Yesterday I was supposed to stream. It was, oh, currently it is uh, Tuesday, by the way. Tuesday the... 28th and uh, I was supposed to stream yesterday but I went to Pole 
and I drained everything of my energy <laughs> and I was just completely out of it yesterday it was kind of insane today I feel a lot better even though I'm still sore I felt a lot better so I'm just cleaning this up this doesn't really I've already kind of put the color in and tweaked it and all that but there's just some spots where where it's kind of strange um, so I have a few things planned for the vlogs. Um, I really want to do a gear video, showing you guys what exactly I'm bringing with me. Packing, I guess. And uh, what I'm going to use for drawing, for work, um, what my suitcase filled with, like maybe clothes even, if you guys are interested. Um, because I'm, I'm trying just to travel with a carry-on suitcase, which is actually harder than I thought it would be. I don't have that many clothes. Like, I, I like having few clothes, but <laughs> it's harder than I thought. Um, so I'm gonna do that for a video, 100%, probably next week. And then I was thinking, if you guys have any questions for me, um, about anything really, but most about my new style of videos, going back to vlogs, and if you guys have any suggestions for what you want to see, if you have any questions for me, I can sit down for Q&A at the end of each vlog. Like, I would love stuff like that. So if you have any questions for me, just leave that in the comment sections. And um, if I heart it, I most likely will respond to it next video. So just keep an eye out for that. Um, if I don't heart it, it might be because somebody else asked the same question or maybe it's not relevant. Um, kind of depends. But. I think it should be fine. It's so different from what I used to do, but I hope it's what I want to do, and I think that's what what matters really. Um, I do feel like it feels more like my old style of vlogs, and if I can do this, then I'll be happy. And I just want to share with you guys. I think that's the main thing. I felt like draw with me, draw what? <laughs> draw with me videos were fun. But it was a bit limiting for what I wanted to do. And also, it seems to go very up and down if people liked it or not, which is also really stressful. So I'd rather do something that I know I like. And then I can kind of blend in all the other things that I like doing, like streams. I can still do, but that's like the whole creation of something. So if I'm going to design something, you guys can come and join me for that. But then if you just want my life updates, you go to YouTube. If you want art updates, you go to Instagram. If you want physical <laughs> postcard rewards, you go to Patreon. Speaking of which, we have changed our Patreon. Uh, well, we, I say, me, have changed my Patreon. And um, there's no longer a Magic Cat package, but I'm still doing a creature design. And it's pretty much through a new character called Juniper. And her travels, well, it's my travels, so you will be funding my travels, which would be great. Um, but through kind of her eyes. So every month we will be designing a new creature, I'm probably on stream. And yeah, I can show you guys. So it is actually. No, not that. <laughs> This little critter is the postcard for this month. It is a snuffle pine, and I had so much fun with it. I love scientific illustrations like this, so this is going to be the postcard. Um, I don't know if it, this video is up before that, I don't think so, but at least you can see what it is. Um, so every month a postcard like this will be shipped to everyone, and that will be the only thing. It's gone down from $15 to $12. Um, so it's a bit cheaper as well, but you also get like art in the mail and you're supporting me directly for my travels So that'd be amazing. So this is Juniper Say hi to Juniper And uh, yeah, that's really exciting too God, I'm not used to talking and drawing <laughs> For a while my, my throat is already Dry, I think just talking continuously is what Kind of kills my voice I also want to talk, so... Oh, now we have shadows. Which I wanted to go for... This one. 
that's just really pretty. So I'm going to shade around every everything that can be in the shadow. So every scale is going to have some sort of shadow to them too, just to kind of push him <laughs> his scales a bit. Because right now they're just lines, but if I add a bit of shadow to them. I'll add some dimension, which is really really fun. Sorry about that. This this stand is not actually meant for this, but it works perfectly, so I'm using it for it. You can see how much more definition that adds to the anatomy of the face. It just pops out a bit. If you haven't been um, following me on Instagram, you probably don't know what I'm doing. This is a monthly challenge that is typical for, well, typically in, um, sorry, I just saw something. Typically in June for Junicorn, but I couldn't do it in June. I was too busy. So I've moved it to July. So it's called July Corn, July Corn, July Corn, I think. And I have just been making unicorns with my own prompts this whole month, and I'm, it's only 15 instead of 31, but it's been really fun. I just really enjoy this a lot. And uh, I'm thinking about doing some August, but I also have a lot more to do in August, so I don't know if I'll be able to. I'll see. <laughs> I'll uh, see what I can do. But yeah, I hope that if you have been following me on Instagram that you've been enjoy enjoying the, the creature design as well. This one, um, well I've done the, all the other ones on stream really, but this one I just started filming because I just got my camera and I was like, hey, let's film it. And uh, it's more more for the vlog thing. Right. I'm doing it a lot rougher now just because it's, it's not bad. It's bigger shapes. Yeah, I'm really sorry about that ticking noise. I actually really want to take it away. It's like a little flap. So if you're using this for your, I think it's meant for um, a computer or anything bigger but I'm using it for my iPad, so I don't really need it. But I keep hitting it, which doesn't annoy me unless I'm filming. <laughs> so yeah, this is definitely not your usual dinosaur, well, dinosaur I say, usual unicorn. But it's a unique unicorn, so it doesn't need to be. I'm going kind of crazy with them. A lot of them doesn't look like horses at all, and I love it. As long as they have one horn, that was my only only thing that I needed to have was a horn. One horn, a singular horn. I think after this one, I had about just a few left, not too many. I don't think I'll <laughs> I don't think I'll make it before the end of the month actually. But then again, I don't care. I'm just having fun with them. This is what I've been longing for for a while, like just having fun with art. And the unicorns kind of brought that back. Which is really nice. Alright, that's the shadows. Really adds a bit, doesn't it? And just a little bit of highlight. Oh, yeah, the only thing I won't be able to do for these, like, draw with me sections, is uh, putting you above, straight above. I'm not gonna bring my giant tripod with me. That would be stupid. <laughs> so it's gonna be from the side. Oh, I don't think I've said this on my on my YouTube channel actually. If you want my brushes that I use for Procreate, this is Procreate by the way. Um, you can get them on Gumroad. I, I'm selling them there. I'm then using the ch -ch -ch charcoal HB for like everything, coloring, lining, sketching, like everything. 
and that's in that brush pack if you guys are interested. It's different from the free version. Um, so yeah, if you guys are interested. Alright. I think it's pretty much done. I'm just gonna do some highlights for the eyes and then I think, I think we're alright. Move that camera a bit. Still a bit out of focus, isn't it? It's always good to check if you can turn off the line art layer and you can still see what it is. That's a really good sign if you're painting it, but I'm not painting it, but it's still good to check. And then I need to give him a highlight. I'm just gonna do that with the one as well. Give it a bit of a shine. Okay, yeah. there we go. I'll put in the actual picture as well so that you can see. So that is the final lizard. Is it rept reptilian unicorn? <laughs> It looks like a lizard, but I gave him like a deer snout. Yay! One thing to check off on my to-do list. Oh, the final piece will be on Instagram, by the way. Woohoo! So, since I'm kind of in the middle of packing and giving away things and also doing patron stuff, I have to wait for some patrons to awaken because it's early in the states at the moment um so i'm just gonna do this thing which is pretty much taking pictures of everything that we're giving away and putting it on the group we have a facebook group for this area and people come and collect things within like a day it's perfect it's so much better than trying to throw things away or going to like a gift shop or anything like that um i already kind of took pictures of this but i'm gonna do it again just better because i was really tired last time i tried and then, um, yeah, I'm just going to sort things down here because I've been wanting to do that. <sighs> and then I'll probably do a uh, Patreon tutorial today. What else did I have to do? I think I'm actually pretty good today. I'm, I'm actually being pretty quick. So, yeah, I'm just going to sort this mess. Good morning. It is Wednesday. The 29th of July, um, I filmed most of what you've seen in the vlog yesterday, the drawing, um, the talking to the camera. I actually sold my camera yesterday, it went so quickly. I'm so happy somebody's gonna get it, get all my extras as well. Um, but yeah, today I mostly need to do Patreon stuff. I need to film a tutorial and I need to write a newsletter. Those are the two things that I really, really need to do. Uh, but also, I really want to sort out this mess in here. Like, we're gonna move in like a week and a half. This is way too much mess. Like, including that. Jesus. So, I might do that as well. But first, I'm gonna make some coffee. <laughs>
in live and the stream chat wants to say hi hi to the vlog <laughs> so we're just gonna do some drawing this is the one that you guys on the vlog has watched and i'm gonna do the mountain today so that's gonna be really cool so yeah a few more hello and then we're getting back to stream and now you're back to the Dina who talked to you in the beginning of this video Hello, welcome back to me. It's now Thursday morning. I'm going to a pole lesson in about an hour, which means that I need to get ready for that. Other than that, today is kind of more of a catch-up day. Well, catch-up day. <laughs> catch-up day. <laughs> I'm going to write a newsletter for my patrons. I'm going to do some sorting downstairs, clean it up. And I'm going to post some stuff. I don't know. It's pretty straightforward. I'm not really doing anything exciting today. I know that I'm going to be pretty tired after the uh, pole lesson, so... Oh, for those who don't know, I do pole dancing or pole fitness. It's fun. I don't strip, I promise. <laughs> I actually got something in the mail yesterday and I thought it would be really exciting to show you on the vlog. Um, it's from Lana J Art on Instagram. And I've been a patron of hers for, oh god, probably over a year, and I have like all her pins. But since COVID happened, um, she couldn't post anything. But I think she just posted like a big, <laughs> there's one more in there, <laughs> a big like um, all the months you missed kind of thing. And now, oh my god, that looks big. I got all these pins. Did I say that I'm moving out and I don't need any more things? <laughs> but... I love, oh my goodness, I just love her art and her pins, she's just a monthly, isn't that insane? So yeah, go check her out on Instagram and on her Patreon, like, how can you not? Oh, there's so much, how is she giving me this much? This is really how much I haven't gotten it. <laughs> Can you even see that? There you go. Did I say that this camera has a really good autofocus? <laughs> this one. The red light is actually the recording light, which I didn't know would reflect. It's kind of weird, but that's okay. I can avoid it. But look at all the pretty stickers. Oh my god. Okay, that this one. Th these what might be my favorite. <laughs> the soda and the. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, kids kids in the treats. You okay, your favorite. Wait, is there a pin? <gasps> there is a kids in the treat pin. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. There we go. Now it's better. Oh, they're so good. They're all rose gold as well. I think all of them, all all oh my god, four pins. All four are rose gold. Look at the beaut. This is a selkie one. I remember seeing this, I was so excited about it. Gosh. I don't even mind that I don't want... I didn't need any more things, but I don't mind. Because this is just such a good... It's holographic. Package. <laughs> but yeah, I should probably stop swooning over... Oh, it's not a bit bent, but that's okay. Um, swooning over... Over little cute things and probably get going because I am going to pole dancing all to a lesson, so I need to go. This is a treat, a treat, they say.
Hi guys, it's now a bit later. Um, I've spent, well it's now, yeah, 3 o'clock, 3 p.m. I spent some time clearing some shelves. So that was all full a week ago or two weeks ago. Clearing more shelves, still more stuff, and more shelves. So that's cool. Getting a little bit closer to moving out. Next week we'll pretty much get rid of everything and wash a lot. <laughs> move out properly. So that's going to be really interesting. So that vlog is going to be that and then the week after that I think it will be me and Phil driving down to uh, London where we're going to stay for just a few days and then I'm going to go to Norway. So that's going to be in that vlog and I'm so excited. That's like the start of the journey. But I thought um, I would just end the vlog here so that I could edit it tonight and have it up for you guys tonight um, so that you have a chance to sign up to my Patreon which is um, you have to sign up before the 1st of August which is Saturday and you'll get this postcard that I showed you guys earlier in the vlog uh, from Juniper, not me, Juniper <laughs> with the snuffle pine so if you want to get that postcard as the first postcard in that kind of series go sign up to the Explorer tier on my Patreon so thank you guys so much for that support and just watching this video and commenting and just liking I think it will really help me get on back on my YouTube feet. I know it's gonna take a bit of time kind of overriding the al algorithm for me not posting for a while and um, I know it's different. I know this is gonna it's gonna take a while um, but I'm just gonna enjoy it. I think the main part is I want to enjoy filming. <laughs> I want to enjoy filming. I want to just share and just have fun with whatever I'm doing. So I hope you guys will like it. I hope you guys like this video. It's very long, I'm sure. Uh, but exciting times. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next week. Bye bye.